Hey everyone, I'm Matt, one of the product managers for Small HD. I'm here to announce that the wait is finally over. We have camera control for Canon. That means we have camera control for C70, C80, C400, C300 Mark III, and C500 Mark II. Which monitors, you may ask? Well, all of our ultra monitors, five, seven, 10 inch, cine monitors, five inch, seven inch, and all of our 4K production monitors. That goes for cine, OLED, quantum. So you can do this on all these monitors, just in a slightly different way each, and we offer Wi-Fi as well as wired connection. So let's get into it. Once you've followed our steps and connected successfully, it's gonna look something like this. Now we go to any page and we're gonna see our camera control anchored in the top of the bottom. Now when you have an EF or an RF lens that has autofocus and it can communicate with the camera, you can have settings in our camera control. So right here you can see we can control the iris. If you don't, it'll be grayed out. Down here you have touch to focus. You'll see a little finger and right now it's grayed out. Let me turn it on and there you go. And finally, one of your most useful features for Canon camera control is run stop. And in the corner you'll see this little red circle. Now we're rolling. Got a little tally here, red border. You can see that you're rolling. You can control shutter. And now you'll see a nice sliding shutter angle setting on the left. ISO, you can change here. Turn on your ND, two stops, four stops, or if you select it in the middle, you could just slide all the way to six stops. Here we have our color profiles and then white balance. Now you can adjust the temperature by sliding up and down, or if you tap it again, you can do the different white balance controls. So let's say you wanna see these a little bit better, a little bit bigger, and have a little extra control. If you go to your collage mode, you'll see that these have grown a lot bigger. We can still let you choose which page and which small HD tools you want while showing your audio levels, your run stops much bigger, time code, it's all listed right here. You may be wondering, where are the deep menu settings? Now with Canon, it will allow us to go into the full Canon menu. So I can use this joystick on the monitor to select all your Canon settings. One caveat, the Canon camera control protocol, the protocol provided by Canon does not allow playback. What about dials? Well, if you click and hold a dial, and now a dial can do shutter, white balance, ISO, FPS, ND, and iris. So I wanna go here and I just wanna control maybe my ND filter, that might be the most useful. I program that to the dial and look at that with a dial. So let's say you have a Cine 7. The deep menu from the Canon camera only allows joystick. Since it only allows joystick, if you have a touchscreen only, we have up, left, right, down, touchscreen controls right here. So you can use it on a Cine 5, Cine 7, or maybe an Ultra if you don't feel like using the joystick. That is a general overview of Canon camera control. Please let us know in the comments what you'd like to see next. I'm Matt, this has been fun.